It's brevity. Stephen works with such certainty. He's really like a one-man army. Because he edits his own stuff. He's shooting it and he's editing it. An accurate reputation for being very efficient. He would shoot it fast. He will get you home early. Detailed genius. Once he hires someone, he's like, I'm trusting you to do the job I hired you for. He's almost edited it in his mind already. Steven just kind of knows what he wants and he comes in and he's like, this is all I need. You guys give that to me and then boom, we move on. You trust him when he goes like, hey, I got it. And you go like, are you sure? And he goes, yeah, I got it. Shoots what he needs. Like, I mean, to almost to a point where as a filmmaker, it kind of made me anxious <laughs> to be quite honest, where I was like, you might need a wide of this. He's like, no, I don't. I mean, he's not just directing the movie from a, an objective perspective, he's involved. He knows when he got it and then we can move on. It's not a lot of repeating the same thing over and over, you know? And if something doesn't work, he has a new strategy immediately. A very light camera, sticking it in glove boxes of old cars and under tables and wherever it needed to be so we could move very quickly and get a lot done in very few takes is just a testament to how confident he is as a filmmaker. It doesn't feel like you're trapped within kind of the cam where the camera is, it, but it's still very, quick making a period film on location during a pandemic was a a tall order and um when you have somebody like steven at the helm it it makes all of those worries kind of dissipate there wasn't like a lot of talking on set there wasn't like a ton of direction it was just sort of you can kind of like read him because he's right there behind the camera it's not just the dp He's actually camera opping the whole entire film. Very short days. And then he would spend the second half of that day effing the movie. So by the time I left, he showed me a really good chunk of the movie already cut together. So I already had a sense of what we were doing. It just very much felt like we were in, in very good hands. Not what you were wearing, but why you are wearing it. You know, those kinds of things. He's really working it out, you know? He's not just like, oh yeah, this is what I know. He grinds and uh, and that's really interesting. It takes a minute before you can trust that, that you really have done what you needed to do and that he really knows. But then you see the end product, you're like, oh, yeah, I guess he really did know. He really knows how to do it all. The result is a film that's exciting, very cool, stylized and socially relevant.